I let out the sheep in the pasture for grace. So about an hour and a half after the sheep then came back in. And I said very strange the sheep came back in. So I realized now three or four mother running around the, the pen here, hollering, looking for the young one. So I got up and figured, well, oh, the, the young one must be left in the pasture there. So I bring the feed, I bring up some feed and run all them back in the pen. As you can see, there is a pen there where we put them in the night. So then I, I realized that we got a count of the sheep inside here, which is 89. 18 ram, 10 young one, and the remainder in you. So after I look around in the pen, I only realized that it got five of the young one. I start look around outside there and I look around. Unfortunate for me, he come for pay me. And when he came now, I tell you about the situation. And then when I do a total check out of 89 now, I only get 67. So then me, he come and we look around and we see where the entrance, where the sheep come. Where I go the fence and they, they, they use it as an entrance across the sheep. And as we investigate further, we go up on the hill there, we see the, the vehicle come over and you see the impression cross. If you all want to look at it when you all come in there, up on the curve there. And then I decide to tell if I got to make a report at the station, and then he, you know, do as, as, as he proceed as a law, you should what you should do. So that was the whole basic of it. Um, I know you're an assistant here, but you're a farmer yourself. How, how big of a, of a law this would be? Well, when, when you multiply 22, or it's, it's five. Is five small you, but when you multiply 17 by 500 dollar, right? You could do the mass, right? And that is a great loss to the farm. It's a real great loss. I call a, another farm, a friend of mine named Mitchell. I know his surname, but I know him by Mitchell. And he tell me that it's only Wednesday morning when he come, he realized that two of his pen was open and about 32 of his sheep was out in the pasture with, with additional two rams from other pen. But I didn't know that it's only this morning when I tell him, then he tell me that I try, like I try to go by he Wednesday and like I didn't got through this so they come here. And I can follow the conversation, we are doing farming just below. If you could, we could step back there, you could look across. We had Melon Tef there Monday and Friday last week. So Priya Larson in Barbados is uh, growing rapidly. You feel this area being targeted in particular? Well, it's it targeting because, you know, it's it very unsecure by, by, by the farmer them that far, the houses them far. So he ain't really got light here, he ain't really got no light there. I just mentioned to him that, you know, the Priya Larson now getting that, they put in, in, a, in a stage you now that you have to go and invest unnecessary money for bringing light bring in camera, you know. And if you go out there and look around, you ain't got no camera for no houses out here. So it 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 getting frustrated, you know. And I ain't seen it gonna stop. Because as as you can see the officer asks you that he gotta do your own you know, that why you do your own investigation. You understand? So how much nitrous you gonna lose? I lose enough look watchman my melon. So it's a great loss to the farm. It's a great, great, great loss. Buy a feed. Buy a feed. Eh? Well, don't talk about your feed. The feed the feed we doing we doing must be about twenty something back feed. That just the pig and the chicken day. Plus labor costs. Water bill. You got annually costs for the for, for, for the land because as you know this from the government. So if you sometimes in farming, if you put pen to paper, people just throw up their hands and say, Man, look, let me down with that shut shop. Because you ain't got no big profit into it. You ain't got no big profit into it. Right? And then you got nothing for do. Sometimes you last chicken in between, you last pigs in between, you know, you last young sheep in between. So, and then now you got great 22 sheep last. So it's a lot. And it, and, and it, I like to tell you, it's hurting the farm. It's hurting the farm.